We move now to the crisis on campus. This after a very disturbing sexual assault allegation at one of America's most prominent colleges, the University of Virginia. The school is now cracking down on all UVA fraternities after an outcry that they failed to respond strongly enough in the first place. And ABC's Bazi Kanani is right there. Good morning, Bazi. Good morning, Paula. A quieter weekend here on Fraternity Row. All of the University of Virginia's fraternities now suspended as the president responds to calls for a criminal investigation and for serious change to protect students. Overnight, protesters in place of partiers at the University of Virginia's fraternity houses voicing outrage over the school's handling of sexual assault cases. It's been anger that this is happening and uh, a little bit of shame. Several angry protests this week sparked by a scathing Rolling Stone article. An 18-year-old freshman telling the magazine the devastating story of her alleged rape by seven young men at a Phi Kappa Psi fraternity in 2012. These are our students, both the victims and the perpetrators. Now the university is taking bolder action, suspending all fraternities and their events for the rest of this semester. Its president writing in a statement, we can demand that incidents like those described in Rolling Stone never happen and that if they do, the responsible are held accountable to the law. The University of Virginia, just one of 86 schools nationwide now under federal investigation over the handling of sexual violence and harassment complaints. President Obama launching a task force in May to address alarming rates of sexual assault on American campuses at private and public institutions like Dartmouth, Princeton and Ohio State University. Here in Virginia, the state's attorney general is appointing a special investigator, and Governor Terry McAuliffe is calling for a zero-tolerance policy to combat sexual assault.